Hi. At first, the Mercedes-Benz ML was equipped with a 3.5 liter V6 petrol and a 5 liter V8. Turbo diesels were represented by a 3.0 liter V6 and a 4 liter V8. After restyling, the petrol V8 increased in volume to 5.5 liters. The base V6 3.5L is the most massive and most problematic. Chronic sore of premature wear of the ceramic metal gear that drives the balance shaft. Because of this, not only did the gas distribution phases leave, but the chips also got into the oil pump, putting it out of action. At the same time, the service will probably offer to replace the valve timing adjustment clutches and the timing chain. Be sure to agree they will not live long either. At the same time, on a run of 50, 80,000 kilometers, the plastic swirl flaps of the intake manifold stuck, which made it necessary to change it entirely. Note that on post-styling machines, these shortcomings have already been eliminated. But the old V8 of the E113 series, inherited from its predecessor, is simply unkillable. What cannot be said about its 5.5 liter successor 450 to 90,000 kilometers you have to update the balance shaft, the replacement of which is no more expensive than that of the V6. Since the engine is not dismantled for this, the common real diesel is generally reliable. Early cars to 150,000 kilometers send with exhaust manifold wear. Apparently, the material of this unit was chosen incorrectly and the metal from its inner surface crumbled, and the wear products, getting into the turbine, killed it. It's a shame, after all, under normal conditions, the resource of the Garrett turbocharger is 350,000 kilometers glow plugs must be changed carefully due to the sticking of the thread. The head of the block can be damaged. Buyers of Mercedes-Benz ML will not have to bother with the choice of gearbox. All cars come with a 7-speed automatic. The valve body often caused trouble. The solenoids of the control valves of which failed by 100,000 kilometers the box began to twitch and stutter during acceleration. If the disease is started, then soon the clutch pack will also infect. After 150,000, the oil pump usually surrenders, the automatic selector refuses to switch, the electronic control unit ECM does not withstand the heat test. But all these defects, except for one leaks in the cooling tubes of the machine, were eliminated after restyling. The pro off-road transmission is durable. The transfer case, as well as the automatic, usually withstands 200,000 kilometers sometimes. Before this period, the chain stretches and the bearings begin to buzz. However, the soundtrack can also come from the outboard bearing, which the dealers change along with the drive shaft. In specialized technical centers, the bearing can be replaced separately. After 150,000 kilometers, you have to change the front gearbox, the imminent death of which will be heralded by hum and vibration. The spring suspension of the standard Mercedes-Benz ML is as strong as tank armor. The first in the front suspension for 60 to 90,000 kilometers are the stabilizer struts. And only to 120 to 150,000 kilometers comes the turn of shock absorbers and lower arms, which become unusable due to the wear of their silent blocks. Rear suspension elements are even more reliable and last one and a half times longer on average. The only exceptions are shock absorbers, nursing an average of 100 to 130,000 kilometers. In steering, after 100,000 kilometers, the thrust is changed. The rail takes care of 200,000 kilometers, but it may begin to leak much earlier than this period. It is eliminated by installing oil seals and seals from the repair kit. And if it starts to tap, the first thing to do is check the steering shaft card in. But the power steering pumps at first often changed under warranty. When replacing, it is advisable to update the tank, the filter mesh of which quickly clogs. Aromatic air suspension is more finicky and expensive. Pneumo cylinders rarely withstand more than 120 to 140,000 kilometers, and they are not cheap. The front ones are assembled with shock absorbers. To prolong their life, it is advisable to rinse the cylinders with each wash. And if the car starts to make extraneous knocks when driving through bumps, 
Check the fastening of the front pneumatic elements to the racks. The fasteners weaken over time and require a banal brooch. The body is distinguished by heroic resistance to corrosion, and the paintwork is durable. Even chrome parts do not lose their gloss for many years. The main thing is that a car handicraftly restored after an accident is not sold to you under the guise of a worthy copy. But with age, the electrician presents unpleasant surprises. There are interruptions in the operation of climate control, the heater motor torments with serenades, air damper servos begin to live their lives. The sound signal and buttons on the steering wheel are buggy, the CD player swallows discs. And the treatment is by no means cheap. If you know of other breakdowns or malfunctions, then tell us about it in the comments. Your review can help others when choosing a used car.